Hey, Coach, uh, second day, everything's figured out, right? Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> How'd it feel? How's everybody looking health-wise? Everything okay? It's good, yeah. We're sta staying healthy, which is important. And, uh, you know, just, just uh, installation and, and guys figuring out, uh, playing with good technique and good sound football. It's, it's coming along. They're chomping at the bit to get hitting, and when, what's the schedule? They are. we got to slow them down a little bit, you know, because they're not in pads yet, and so it's a little bit of a fake football deal for the O-line, D-line, um, and so we've got to slow them down, make sure that they're not, um, you know, banging their shoulders and make sure they're using their hands and stopping when they need to stop. But uh, it, it's, it's, been a, it's been a good, uh, not a surprise, but a good thing to be able to hold them back instead of have to get them going, you know. You always want it that way with your team. Do you feel like it's an advantage that uh, th there's a whole installation of an offense going on, and they kind of they're kind of cheating because they they're the defense they get to just watch and, and go after them because these guys are kind of getting to know a new offense. Well, I think you know for both of us, we're not really paying much attention to what they're doing as far as just making sure that we're sound on our side of the ball because we still have assignments that we've got to sure up on uh, at all positions, and so um, I think that's the same thing that's going on on the offensive side. We're we're uh, trying to make sure that we just got everybody in the right place at the right time. You can't talk to your new guys. How are they doing? Are they settling in, transfers? Yeah, and yeah, yeah. Yesterday was a little bit of a shock for them, the the, the speed of things, but also just uh, how much uh, they're doing. You know, it's a little bit more complicated as far as what they've been used to, I think. But once uh, once they get it down, and relying on the veterans to, to teach those guys and bring them along has been huge, and the veterans have been good that way. You know, not not selfish, but sharing their knowledge and being around with the young guys. But uh, I think they're just kind of hanging back a little bit, trying to get used to everything, get the defense before they they uh, really feel comfortable under their own skin. But right now, it's you can you can tell a little bit of a shot, a little little shot going on. How are the coaches meetings? You guys feeling good as a staff? You guys, uh, I mean, it's pretty new for everybody together. Feeling pretty energetic. Yeah, I this spring was huge for us to be able to be together, um, and they're just kind of picking up where you left off in the spring and and uh, making the adjustments that we need to and. You know, trying a couple of new things that we picked up in the summer and in, in professional development. But we're, yeah, I love, I love my room. I've got really good coaches in there with me, really good graduate assistants, and uh, we're excited about the room that we've got defensively. Just day two of fall camp, but what are some of the bigger changes you've seen from spring ball to right now in your guys? How big and fast they are. <clears throat> you know, in spring ball, obviously nobody's really in uh, in football shape, but I think that our strength coach Nutafisi has done a great job. Him and his staff doing a great job. They're they're here. They're they're excited. They're, they've got pep in their step, and um, the, the size and speed that we're seeing them at now is, is a lot different from spring, which is really, really impressive. How did Harvey Long you look at uh, defensive linemen? He's explosive. He's really explosive. Um, you know, new new position, and so the nuances of being able to play DN, he's, he'll, he'll learn it, and that time will come. He's just got to get reps, but um, the tools that he's got and the tools that we have to use, you know, while we're using him, uh, we're excited about because he's, he's something different. It's, we're just trying him out there. You know, he played a little bit of backer yesterday. He played mostly backer yesterday, and so um, depending on on how we feel as we go back and watch film, but I mean, it's, I think it's. It, any backer that you take, if you take Francis and move him there and put him at DN, he's going to look a lot faster than everybody else, and I think it's just a natural thing. But Harvey looks looks pretty natural there. He's got really good hips, and and uh, it, it'll be good. It'll be good to try him out there. How much are you still experimenting with personnel and schemes versus, okay, let's get the playbook down and kind of what we want to run? No. Um, most of the experimenting, if we're talking about experimenting, is really just uh, new things that we've picked up in the summer when it comes to technique. But it's it's uh, the stuff that we've been running in the spring is really what we're trying to shore up. Um, and it's there, there aren't too many schematical things that we're going to change from the spring till now. It's it's going to be our defense that we've been doing. I feel like the guys are acclimating to the 4-3, going the 4 and just making that transition, playing that way. It's been good. It's been good. Um, you know, it's... Uh, the, the, the guys that have moved positions in order for us to do that have have, uh, have been good and uh, you know but also them having a history of being able to play in an odd front gives us a little bit more multiplicity in our fronts and so we'll, we'll, we'll use a little bit of that too I feel like you've settled into your role no <laughs> 
Not really, but you know, I've, I've got great a great head coach to lean on. You know, Ed Lamb was the head coach for a long time, a great defensive mind. You know, uh, Coach Galfusi's been around for a long time. You know, Gennaro's new, but he's a great technician, and we, I think we've got a good room. So I've uh, the, the the trust factor in our room is is huge for me to be able to lean on guys and be open, and I don't ever feel like they're holding things back or you know sitting and waiting to fail. We're all in it together, and we're all pushing the same direction. So that's been that's been awesome to have. Up at the second day of uh, fall camp, what's it been like out here with the, uh, getting these guys in shape after uh, the long summer? It's it's good. You know, I, like I said, the, the strength coach has done a great job with getting them ready. <clears throat> um, they look great. They look great. Now we just got to keep them healthy. Um, get all the get all the players that are that are going to play for you to the first game, and and I think that we'll have a chance to be competitive the whole year if we can keep them all healthy. Four, three, kind of hybrid, you know, things that they don't, don't give it too much, but uh, how's the, how the players coming in terms of terminology, technique, and adjustments to the new Yeah, it's, it's coming. It's coming. It's learning, learning, new learning for all the guys that just showed up on campus, but, um, you know, I, I think they're picking it up pretty, pretty fast. Yesterday, there were a lot of mistakes, especially in the front, but uh, today, it seemed like from one one day of film to the next, there's a lot of improvement. We've been we've been happy to see that. You've coached various, various places, uh, various colleges. What's it been like coaching these guys here at BYU? It's been fun, you know. I think being around kids in general is uh, is an awesome thing to, to be a part of, to be a part of their lives. But these kids, you know, obviously there's, there's a lot of mature kids, but you know, it doesn't matter what school you're at. Everybody comes from a different walk of life, and it's fun to, to get to know kids at a, at a personal level and be involved with them, you know, whether you're a mentor or, or, or whatever. But it's th these kids are awesome. It's been fun to get a, get, a, get to know them. It's like being a mentor, fun to get 120 kids. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Yep. <laughs>